Hi guys! Today we are going to work on pop-up art. It's going to be Mother's Day soon. I don't know about you, but I usually, when I was a little girl, I would make cards for my mom. And I think I'd like to teach you a very special card where you, when you open it, things go pop and it goes up and it'll be really, really cute. For this project, we will need a cardstock. I think I gave you one in your supply. Um, if not, that's okay. You just go and use any colored paper. You also need colored papers. Any color will work. A glue and scissors and a lot of love. So let's go ahead and start. First, get your cardstock and you fold it into half, just like so. Have somebody help you if you cannot fold it properly. That way, your card is even, not where one is one, the, both sides would be equal instead of one bigger than the other. So just go ahead and ask your older brother or your mother and father, or well, since it's a prayer for mom, don't ask mom to help you or your dad, or yeah, a sibling, to help you fold your card. There you go, I have mine folded. Set that aside. Then, we're going to go and cut our flower. Um, we just need little pieces of squares, and we're going to cut and make a tulip form of a flower. I'm gonna show you how I did it. So I had one that I've cut already, and you just make a, you just follow the lines. No, just follow that line. So you have this right there. Then you cut it. Follow the line that you just made, then cut it. And when you open it, you have a tulip. Now you need to make six of these. I already made some right there. Okay. Right here. I have one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, I have seven. I don't need a lot of... Mm, what do I want to remove? I'll take one of the red out I think nah nah yeah I'll take one of the reds out all right so what do we do you get one of your flowers you put glue on it glue another peak flower next to it there you go and then take this end here put glue get another color glue it in there another glue that part again get another color put it in there and then get put your glue again get another flower glue it in there okay. then with your last one, glue it again in there. Okay, there you go. All your flowers are glued together. See that? Next, let's go ahead and fold that. I want kind of want to wait for it to dry, but since we don't have that luxury. What we need to do now is get your paper, get your cardstock, put a glue on one side of your flower first. Okay. Then, put the whole thing in the middle, glue it down. And then, this side, glue it. 
fold it in. You got to fold it. So that you just let that piece or that side glue itself on the on the flower. So when you open it, all your flowers should open up like so and i glued them way too much that it's glued together i am upset now there we go so there okay make sure you don't put too much glue or else it'll sip through the other flowers and it's going to see there see right there next let's go and get a green color paper and that's going to be our stem Let's cut it. Oh, too much. Fold it in half. Put a glue right there. Okay. And we'll put our stem right there. I'm putting way too much glue. Ahaha. You don't want to do that because when you fold it, it's going to get in there and now your whole card is going to be glued together then we can use our um green again and we can make leaves leaves are easy curl it there curl it there and you have leaves see that Put it there. Mm. I hate the fact that I put too much glue. All right, be very careful with your glue, okay? Don't put way too much glue or else your flower will so now we have, once you close that, and your mom opens it, he has a beautiful flower pop-up. Then you can just put whatever you want to write for your mother. So let's go and write. Happy. I'll put black because it will be seen. Happy Mother's Day And then you can draw hearts all over and then write your name what do you think be sure to greet your mother happy mother's day all right bye now <laughs>